Okay, so we're going to be talking about the Asus Transformer Book T100TA and its audio issues. So things that will cause audio issues on this laptop are some major Windows updates will sometimes throw off the drivers and also reinstalling Windows and sometimes upgrading from Windows 8 to Windows 10 will cause the audio to not work. So as you can see down there, it shows a little X because there's no audio output devices available. Um, so that means the speakers won't work and the headphone jack won't work. They just don't do anything. So the way to fix that is I emailed the Asus representatives and they gave me um, a driver for the chipset, the Intel uh, processor. They gave me a driver for it that when you install it, it allows Windows to figure out what the driver is for the audio. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to do that. So real quick, um, you're gonna wanna head over to a web browser and you're gonna want to open up my YouTube page, Dylan's Tech, and then go to the description of this video where you'll find this link. So you're gonna to wanna to click on this link. It's by Asus, there's no viruses on it. You can scan the downloaded package um, if you want to, but it's straight from Asus. Um, and then you're gonna to wanna to save as a downloads. So um, if you're using Chrome, then it'll do that automatically, but I'm just using Edge because this is a fresh install of Windows. So you're gonna to wanna to save it to downloads and then just go ahead once that's saved. Um, it's gonna go ahead and download it here. Here we go, We're, we have it downloaded. So I'm gonna go ahead and head into File Explorer so that we can go ahead and get it opened up. So it's right here. Uh, it's gonna be a zipped file. You're gonna to wanna to go ahead and extract all of that out onto its own folder. So we'll just go ahead and do Enter just to do that real quick. Shouldn't take all that long. Okay, just like that, our files are done extracting. So you're gonna see this right here. It's called Setup and it's an application. You're gonna to wanna to go ahead, double click on that to go ahead and open the installer for the drivers. You're gonna get a pop-up like this. You're gonna to wanna to select a yes. You're gonna to wanna to hit next. And then you're gonna to wanna to accept the agreement. And then you're gonna to wanna to hit next. And then just like here, it's gonna say it's gonna install the drivers for the Intel Atom processor. Um, and then you're gonna to wanna to hit next. And then just like that, we're getting our drivers installed so that this laptop will be able to work. So there we go. As you can see, the drivers have successfully installed. So you're gonna to wanna to select yes. I want to restart the computer now just to go ahead and make sure that it gets the drivers and it's uh, all good to go. Okay, so as you can see, we're back on the desktop. And now if we go down here to sound, and we click on the device, you can see that it brings up the device and you can hear our volume is now working. So I hope this video has helped you to get your audio working on your Asus Transformer Book T100TA with the Intel Atom processor. So hope this video has been helpful. We'll catch you in the next one.